Hey guys, welcome to another video of Microsoft Office Tutorials. In this video, we are going to discuss three amazing quick tricks of Microsoft Word. Before we start the video, if you have not been subscribed to our YouTube channel, Microsoft Office Tutorials, please subscribe it now and press the bell icon button so that you don't miss any new incoming video. So let's start. In this video, the first quick trick that we need to discuss is how we can shrink or how we can fit the whole text on one page in Microsoft Word. Here we have some text that is on two pages. Let's say we want to shrink or we want to fit this whole text on one page. How we can do that? To do that, we have a few steps. We need to go to File tab. In File tab, we need to go to Options. In Options, we need to go to Quick Access Toolbar. In Quick Access Toolbar, we need to change here from Popular Commands into All Commands. In All Commands, we need to look for Shrink One Page. So here we have Shrink One Page. We need to select this. We need to click on Add button. Then we need to click on OK button. And then we will see here icon for Shrink One Page. So as we need to shrink this whole text on one page, we will select this whole text. We will click on this button and here we go. Now the whole text is on one page. Our second quick trick is how we can add custom drop down list in Microsoft Word. Here we have an admission form in which I have been added different drop down list for different fields. For example, for gender, male or female. For nationality, different country names from which student need to choose. Then here, last past standard, let's say from first to ninth standard. Then admission standard in which student want to get admission from first to tenth standard. So how we can add such custom drop down list in Microsoft Word? So to add custom drop down list, let's say I will just delete this drop down list and I will add here new custom drop down list. To add custom drop down list, we need to add here one more tab that is developer tab. To add developer tab, we need to go to file tab. In file tab, we need to go to options. In options, we need to go to customize ribbon. In customize ribbon, you will see here developer tab. We need to check this box for developer tab. We need to click on OK and then we will find here one more tab that is developer tab. In developer tab, we have here drop down list. To add drop down list, let's say we want to add drop down list here. So we will click here. We will click drop down list and here we have drop down list. Now at this time we don't have anything in this drop down list. So we need to add data. To add data in drop down list we need to go in properties. In properties to add data we will click on add button. Let's say we want to add here male and female. So first let's say we add here male. We will go ok again second female and we will go for ok. Again ok and now we should have here two options male or female. So this was our second quick trick. Our third quick trick is how we can change or how we can convert number into text in Microsoft Word. Let's say we have this number and we want to change this number into text. We need to double click on this number to select this whole number. Then we need to press Ctrl plus F9 to insert curly brackets. Then we need to insert equal sign before number and after number we need to insert backslash asterisk sign and then we need to add card text. Then after that we need to right click on this and we need to select update field. And here we go 456,789. Now we have been converted number into text in Microsoft Word. So friends this was our third quick trick of Microsoft Word. If you like this tutorial please don't forget to give thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel Microsoft Office Tutorials. Also don't forget to share this knowledge with your friends. Thanks for watching. See you in next video. Bye bye.